Okay, I'm going to show you quick like how to <coughs> uh, run iSweasel as a non-root user. So first thing we're going to do, open up a terminal window and we're going to grab this uh, program called sucks, S-U-X. So, yeah, get install sucks, I already have it. Okay. So then the, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and we're going to add a user. So we're going to use this add user and then um, since I already have a user in there, um, but it's just add user and the name of the user, like something like this. So add user and then hit enter and it'll prompt you for passwords and some other shit. And you put that in. Okay, <clears throat> and then so once you have your new user added, um, the context of uh, running sucks is just and so sucks the username and then the uh, program you want to use as uh, the non root user. So bam, okay. Now, um what we're going to do is we'll, we'll go ahead and copy this, um, control shift C, and we're going to go ahead and, and go to this launcher here, the iSweasel launcher, we're going to go to properties, and then there's the command that's going to open it, just um, highlight that, exit out, and uh, we'll go ahead and uh, paste from the command line in there, and then uh, bam. And you'll notice it's running as our non-root user. And that's pretty much that. So easy squeezy.